is the LSAT going to be offered more frequently now that it's online? Well, they already made it a bit more frequent in the past couple of years. It used to be only yeah. four times a year. Now it's nine or 10 times a year. So it's almost every single month. So it's a lot okay. more frequent than in the past. The GRE is even more frequent. The GRE, at least when it was in person, was nearly every single day. I'm not sure what the situation is now, but it's still relatively frequent. So it's almost like the next one is August 29th, then October 3rd. So only about a month between those, then mid-November. So they're still fairly often. And so does the time, now that you've mentioned that, because I didn't know they were that often now, the space between them, does that give you enough time to get your scores back and re-register if you would like for the next LSAT? That would be ideal. That would be nice if they structured it in a way where you get your score and you can still decide whether to take it within a few weeks afterwards. Unfortunately, the, there's overlap there. So you get your score back after the registration deadline has already passed yeah. for the next one typically, which means you've got to register not knowing if you're going to need it and then potentially waste the registration fee, which is unfortunate. And they could be better about that sort of thing. So yeah, it's, it's a gamble. And the safer course of actions is unfortunately the more expensive one. So think about, think about that carefully. Those, you, if you have financial hardship, you can apply for a fee waiver, which gives you a couple of LSAT tests for free. So I would encourage folks and to- And that, that applies to LSAT Flex as well? It does, yeah. So that's a good option too. Thanks for tuning into the show. Please subscribe if you haven't done so already to be notified of new episodes as I release them. And feel free to reach out if you need anything at all as you move forward with your prep. I'm happy to help however I can. In the meantime, I wish you all the best and take care.